Today we're looking at this DTP08 counterbalance unit with a cylinder lifting attachment on the front. So to lift this gas cylinder, we move the unit forwards, nice and gently, just until the pads touch against the cylinder. We don't want to push the cylinder, we just want to come up against it. Put our brake on to keep the unit steady. Come around and take our hook on the front, and this hooks around the cylinder onto the opposite side. We then take our slack, we open up the ratchet, and pull through any slack. This means that the band is nice and tight. We then operate the ratchet. When it's tight, we fold this back so it's nice and neat and closed. I can see this strap's very tight, perfect. We now come around the back, can release my brake, and then pump the handle to raise the load. With this model, we've got 500 millimetres of lift stroke beneath the cylinder. We can move the unit around. It's a counterbalance design so with a steering wheel at the rear. So as we turn this tiller, we can control the unit. The unit has counterweight in the back of the box to offset the weight of the cylinder. When we get to our destination or we get to the platform where we're going to load this cylinder onto, we come here and we have a black lowering handle. We turn this anti-clockwise and that lowers down the cylinder. Once it's down, we come around the front, we pull this release lever here and open up the ratchet. Holding the slack end, we pull it around 180 degrees until it clicks. Once it clicks, we pull the ratchet out, still pulling the lever, and this pulls all the slack out and makes it nice and slack. We can then unhook our hook from the other side. Come around the back and we pull the unit away. With this model, we can offer it in stainless steel, we can offer it for ATEX areas, and we can offer higher or taller lift heights if required.